Yeah. 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 Check this for a fishing mark. Right, welcome back. This is only going to be a uh, short session while I'm waiting for the lads. Um, I've literally arrived here. Daniel and uh, Adam, they've been fishing all day. Uh, they've been camping here. So they, while they're having their tea, uh, just thought, um, get on these rocks and then uh, wrinkle maybe a ras, pollock, chance of bass. I've got my 10 foot spinning rod with me, uh, 5000 spinning reel. I've uh, got a running ledger on, about 2 or 3 foot long smooth, 2 0, chinny hook on it, fresh the pump below, look. It's chucked it down there, near the, the, near the kelps and rocks, see any ras, maybe a bass, chance of pollock. Um, I'm pretty sure this uh, beach produce uh, turbot as well but I've never fished here before so looking at the ground it's a chance all them species so wish me luck on the hour or two and then we're gonna move to somewhere else fish for bass maybe a gilted so stay tuned hopefully we can a nice uh, fish out of here in the next an hour or so if I do I get back to these guys and there we have it cracking size ball and rush right get it on up and uh, give you a better show guys there we go lovely Possibly PB ball and rust. I've had the first cast bite, uh, cast it into the bay, missed it, and then I've had another cast, nothing, and just decided to drop it down the rock here. Uh, first one, first drop, missed, and second drop, took it. Happy with that? Lovely ball and I'll get it released now. I uh, missed the bite before. Yeah, cast it into the bay. Uh, it was either a small bass or maybe a gilted. Uh, I've heard some gilted see as well. But decided to just drop it down the wall here, down the rocks. And boom! <laughs> it was well over two pounds. I thought I was going to break my rod but managed to land it yeah this time just passed into the bay now uh, there's a bit of a kelp and rocks uh, middle of the bay so I aim, just aimed near it so hopefully some uh, some fish about bite bite Get a bite now. Yeah, just aim near the rocks there in the middle of the bay. I might be some bass or maybe a guilt hit about. Just had a knock then. Let's 
see if he comes back. Right, this is the rig I've got. Basically just from the ledger. Got two foot long trace. Nice juice of blow look and two o. I think they are two o. Shinny. Possibly a bit too big for rat fishing. You want to maybe size one, even size six for rat fishing. But my aim, my aim was to uh, catch bass. Keep missing the bite into the bait. Don't know what they are, but um, just can't seem to connect them. So what I'm gonna do is just drop it down the hole again. I mean down the rocks. The wind picking up as well. Literally howling. Edible crab, but not not in size. Chuck it back now. See ya. Here's my bait. I think I should be still alright. Well, maybe now a minute. Drop it back down again. And there we go. Second rush. Probably slightly smaller than the first one. Look at, look at them mashes there. Uh, Dan's here, joined me. He's low fishing now. He just had a good take, but come off. Uh, oh, get this on up now. And uh, get this on back. Last look. There you go, guys. Oh, you got one. Pollock, yeah. Pollock on the there. Pollock on a sidewinder. Sidewinder. Get in, get in. Yeah. That was probably it, wasn't it? Before yeah. yeah. It took. Why sidewinder, little yeah. Pollock? Get in. Fish on. Second cast, nice. Second cast, yeah. Fish on again. Pollock? Yeah, no. Can you see it? No, it's quite like a Pollock. Oh, it's not, it's fast. Yeah? Is it? Is it? No. Oh look. I thought it was a bass then. <laughs> I thought it was a bass. Oh no, he liked it proper white. Yeah. Isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, he's not a very dark pollock at all. Second pollock on the white sidewinder. Second one. Literally been here two minutes. Yeah, three casts, two fish. Three casts, two fish. White sidewinder, Lord. Well done, Dan. Thank nice you. fish. On a small boat. Good spot on a yes. little spinning gear. Exactly, yeah. Right, get my gear now. Oh 
don't know. Third time lucky. What I've done before, just chuck it here near the rocks. A lot of kelps and the rocky patches there. Another small ras. Typical when you turn the camera off, they bite. When you put put the camera on, they don't bite. I right, get it, get it on up and get it released now. Decent fish, Dave. Yeah? Decent fish. Missed it. Oh, I got, didn't get the run on camera. Where is it? Don't know. Because, don't rub it against the rocks there. I took in drugs and everything. Sorry? It was taking drugs? Yeah, taking drugs. Metal jig, just chicken it. What was it? Metal? Metal jig. What could it be? Grass is it? Maybe. Oh. Oh no, nice pollock. pollock. Do, you want me to, do you want me to lift it? Done. You okay lifting it? You got it, yeah? Oh, biggest one off the session. <laughs> Decent, that. Nice polish. Yeah, yeah. Very nice polish. Let's have a look. Look at your lures on that. Wow. Pop a vent for it. Don't say the eye. I reckon we can get it out. Yeah. Oh, there we go, it's come up. Yeah. I'll hold him up for the camera. Well done, Dan. Nice. Thank you. Lovely. Very nice. Like a little fight with it. Very good fight. Pulled loads of drag. Yeah, yeah. Um, lovely fish. We're getting back. Getting back, yeah. Go. Go. Well, just having a last cast here on the rocks, and uh, we're gonna make a move and uh, fish a beach mark nearby. Hopefully, cast on bass. But last cast in now. Well, last cast going in now. Let's go. Thank 
<laughs> I think I've got that on the camera. Nice Kelpie bone mass. Took it right in again. Get on up and uh, get it some back and start packing up. Back to the car and move to the next mark. Cheers guys. Nice piece for them. Cool. 